your favorite uh, segment, mm-hmm. the Weekly Pervert News. Dudes. I didn't work. And now I look this, like a witch. Oh, if, there we go. Well, <laughs> Fuck you, KK. If you don't know how to do it, don't do it. You all right? I, I, I tried. You know, I tried to try to be don't, like don't, part of the show. Don't, don't embarrass yourself, all right? Just be yourself, all right? Don't don't try to be me and shit. All right, I'll, I'll be I'll be myself. There Sorry. you go. There you go. There you go. What are you? Night. Crazy ass motherfucker. All right. This week again on the weekly pervert news. It's uh-huh. a it's an update on Eric Weinberg. Again. Remember, uh, fucking that guy from the from the Scrubs, uh, Dak Braff. Who know was dating the little woke ass Yelena, you know, little black widow, little wannabe big ass blonde motherfucking flowers pew and shit. You know, remember that? And uh that she fucking uh dumped his ass because he, uh, he was too old and his dick didn't get hard anymore and she went over there to be in that dude don't worry darling, uh with that fucking uh Olivia Munn and fucking Harry Styles and they're over there and Shia LaBeouf was over there pissing off with her and shit because she didn't want to get her pussy licked and ass licked and she'd rather do it by Harry Styles and shit, because that's the way the movie went. Uh you remember what I was talking about, all that shit? But wait, who's the pervert? The, the producer from the show Scrubs, that guy Eric Weinberg, Kike. that guy he fucking. <laughs> Why did you need to fucking bring up fucking Zach Braff and then Pew, dude? Like they have nothing to do with this. So some people don't know who the fuck Eric Weinberg is, and so I gotta explain <laughs> that he's a producer from the show Scrubs, and for the people okay, who yeah, don't know Scrubs, good. I gotta explain. Scrubs yeah, okay. is a show that has Zach Braff and we're in it. Yeah. And for the people who don't know that the, the who Zach Braff is, because they're woke as fuck motherfuckers who were born in 1997 and shit, I gotta mention Squirrel <laughs> Florence Pew, and then I gotta mention about the relationship mm. and all that bullshit, and this is how I tie everything to character. So I reach the whole okay. world, and not just one demographic, you dick. Okay, and you've been reading a lot of, like, internet fucking, like, articles where they're like uh well we're gonna talk about this and then they fucking give you the history of everything and they're like and at the end this is what happened but what they can't that's every every says yeah yeah <laughs> hey yeah stop doing that man it, right. okay anyways Eric Weinberg, this fucking per- yeah 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 this is a guy who is going around and telling women come over to my house and i'll pay you money i'm a producer and I'm gonna shoot you in underwear or or bikinis and shit. And you're gonna be Jesus famous. Christ. And they would go, and he would give them money, and he would molest them and shit. And he did this for years, from 2014 all the way until now, until he got caught. Anyways, uh, he was in. He, you know, we talked about this already, uh, but mm-hmm. he's been. Uh, he went over there and he tried to fucking say he was not guilty and all that shit. You know, some of these bitches asked for it, but he, I hope he has proof, maybe some <laughs> videotape, so he can declare himself innocent. I don't know. I'm what not saying it? he's. It innocent. was different times. I don't. I'm not saying he's innocent, but maybe he has videotapes, and those bitches are gonna lose if he has videotapes, because that's why I recommend everybody do to make sure you get some videotapes and shit. Uh, ask him for it. I mean, ask them for it and make them say yes. All right. But anyways. Uh, make them say so yes. Not, I mean, I mean, if they say no, then it's okay. It's not consensual. Then don't do it. All right. But if they say yes, you know, because I don't know, you got maybe your voice got a little. <laughs> Knowing you, you think you're, you're thinking like if it if they say no, it's not consensual. If they say yeah, it's sensual. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. But anyways, anyways, this motherfucker asked for bail, uh-huh. five million dollar bail. I'll pay five million dollars. Five million dollars. You let me free shit. shit. And then the, the judge says, no, you're going to stay in jail until we start the trial because you're a menace to society and you fucking uh, you molest women. And we let you out or you're going to go and molest other women. And we can't have that shit. So you're staying in jail. <laughs> Don't give a fuck how rich you are and what celebrities you know. Yeah, yeah. You're, just, you're talking like a fucking five year old. No, we're not going to let you out because then you'll molest women. And yeah. then if you <laughs> I'm putting the jits of it. I'm doing the jits of it, you dick. I'm doing the jits of it. You're simplifying things. You're simplifying things. Okay, I, I get what you're coming from. I, I see. Yeah, well, go ahead. I mean, fucking, uh, fuck this guy. 
<laughs> the co-producer says <laughs> to the lady who's <laughs> trying to hit a roll. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah. Well. So. so uh huh. That's it. They keep it in. <laughs> They're keeping him. They're keeping him in jail until they start the good, trial. Good, dude, he's a good, menace. He's a danger to society. He's the judge said he rapes women. He molests women. He doesn't rape them. He molests them for money that they agreed for. Probably okay. First of all, all take. of that is horrible. All of that is horrible. But if he had to fucking like tell little fucking children stories, or I mean, like the news, this is the way they would be like listening to the news. <laughs> Hey, like shit like this, make sure you like and subscribe to our channel and check out the full podcast on the link to the right where we discuss more topics we don't post on these short videos. Peace.